Super cool party people and welcome to Wednesday. It's um, I don't know what it looks like outside. I woke up probably about half an hour ago or so, 9.20 ish, and um, I haven't moved since. Ugh. There we go. We're a little, are we more put together? I don't know. Plans for today, definitely, I think I want to do some more editing, but also I don't feel like moving out of bed at this point, so we'll see what happens. I also low-key want to film a bunch of D&D &D videos, so I have those to edit, um, so maybe we'll do that, but that also requires getting out of my bed, so... For the moment, the update is I'm conscious and refusing to move. There we go. Um, I just wanted to start the vlog because I am awake, so I figured might as well. Alrighty, so I am up now and kind of mobile. I'm just trying to decide what I want to do today. I It's it's just before noon. I'm trying to decide if I want to go out and eat something or go out and get something and cook it or try to find something in the house. These are These are struggles that I currently have, so... That's where I'm at. I'm up. I'm moving. I'm not fully dressed because those are my pajama pants, but who likes putting clothes on ever? <laughs> I honestly, if I could live in my sweatpants or my pajamas all the time and I do my best to do so, 100% I would. But yeah, I'm kind of hungry, so I'm thinking, I'm thinking I might just pack up my laptop and head out, get lunch, then go write. We'll edit. A little stressed to get back into that to be honest. I don't want to film today though I decided that so hopefully I'll stick to those guns. I think I am contemplating going into work tomorrow or Friday. I might go into work Friday so tomorrow I can film all day or maybe vice versa. I don't know. We'll see. But anyways I'm rambling now trying to figure out what I want to do out loud. It's not working so I'm gonna go and I'll check in with you hopefully later once I've figured out what the heck I'm doing. I look like such a nerd. The decision has been made. I <laughs> It's the hair and the glasses. And I'm gonna go out, I'm gonna grab something to eat. I've packed up my bag with my laptop and my notes. And um, hopefully I can be productive. I just, I have a feeling that if I stay home because the first step in getting to that next revision is big, you're starting a new revision, it's a big step. I have a feeling that if I stay home, I just won't do it. So I'm gonna go out, I made a list also to work on today. I have to reset my calendar because April is done. So got a lot of stuff to do on this May the 1st. So yeah, hopefully I'll be able to stay focused and get some things done. I'm feeling pretty good. It should be okay. It'll be fine. Yeah. Okay, so I am back home now. I didn't even get through a chapter because it's a long chapter and there's a lot that I have to add and I can't skip it this time. I skipped a little bit, not gonna lie, but I'm not gonna skip the very end of this. So yeah, I'm about five pages in, 147 more to go, I think. <laughs> so many, but um, it's going all right so far. I just, I was having problems focusing, which I thought I would jumping back into this, but I still did all right, I think. But yeah, so I'm home now. I'm gonna do a little bit of puttering, probably take care of that, put away my clothes that I folded yesterday and then never touched, and then, um, yeah, I don't really know from there. We haven't got past that. I do want to at least finish one chapter today, though. Oh, and I should do the calendar, because that's kind of a thing that I use on a daily basis. All right. Putter, make bed, calendar. That's the plan. We'll see if it happens. Okay, so bed is made, clothes are put away, which is just fabulous for me. I even got rid of the box that Abby sent me my gift in. It's in the recycling now, although in all fairness, like I'm so bad at bringing my recycling up. It's so bad. <laughs> it's so bad, but I, sh I should do that this week. But now I think it's time to take care of my calendar. So I'm gonna wipe that off and then set new goals, I guess, for the month. So. The thing with my calendar is I used it to keep track of writing goals. Last month I used it to keep track of workouts and queries. Queries didn't go so well. We tried, but it didn't go so well. 
So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm going to wipe this off, set up the May calendar, and then decide what my goals are for this month. Yay! <laughs> yeah, I think I'm gonna do, instead of chapters based, I think I'm gonna do word count based edit goals this time. It was really difficult English <laughs> just because with chapters it's like all or nothing whereas if I just do like word count based then it's better it feels better so I'm gonna wipe this off now and then we'll see how we go and I'll let you know I guess what my goals are at the end of it alrighty so it is about quarter to five and um, I finally got the calendar set up it's not exciting at all right now because it's just blank and it has some goals so goals we're again going with 15 queries probably won't make it but it's on the list <laughs> Um, going from 15 workouts up to 20 workouts, because I think I did over 20 last month anyway, so should be fine to get that. I also want to start going outside, maybe going for walks, maybe going for runs, I don't know, we'll see. So I put five of those on the list. And then my editing goals have to be 4,000 words a day, which is crazy, but... That's what it needs to be. It actually needs to be over 5,000 to get this edit done by the end of the month, but I'm hoping if I put 4,000 and then I just have some really banner days, I'll manage to finish this edit by the end of the month. But also I have to write like six chapters, so it'll be a stretch to finish this edit by the end of the month, but fingers crossed I can get there, but it should be in a pretty good place by the time I finish it, and then the other edits won't be as terrible, hopefully. So that's the plan. I'm just chilling here, getting into writing in a bit, I think. But I'm getting a little bit hungry, so I might have dinner soon. So just try to figure it out. Okay, so I ate dinner, which is awesome. Although, I mean, I guess it's earlier than I've been eating lately. I prefer to eat later. I don't know. So it's only about 20 to 6 right now. My mom's on her way over because her Kobo isn't working. And maybe I can fix it. I don't know. I don't have one. I have a Kindle that sits in. I think it's this box here that I never use. So, mm, yeah. But she's on her way over, and I'm working on edits. I've already done over 3,000 words today, though, so I'm going pretty well. And then I have, like, you can't really see, but I have these big blocks here of all caps, which I get to delete, which I don't know if that'll help my word count. It probably won't, but... There's less I think that I need to edit than I think there is, so it should be okay. Anyways, that's where we're at, and um, yeah, I look kind of like a crypt keeper. Okay, cool, I'm going. Alrighty, so my mom came over. I don't think I mentioned it, but her Kobo e-reader tablet thing isn't working properly. Um, she was on the phone with support yesterday, I think, and they tried to walk her through how to fix it, and like sent her an email about how to you know, update because the one that she has is no longer supported by automatic updates. You have to go in and update it yourself. And I tried and I'm pretty good with technology, but it was not working. It would say it updated and then it still wouldn't work. So I don't know. She's had it for like seven years though. So it served her well. So hope hopefully they said that they're still working on it. Hopefully they can figure out what the problem is, but if not, well, it served her well <laughs> but yeah that was like two hours of my life trying to get that sorted and it didn't work and also my mom smokes and when she's reading she's usually smoking on her thing and it's got a cover and so I've been having allergic reactions since then so that's that's nice have a bit of a headache a bit of troubles breathing <coughs> it's awesome but that's not why I picked up the camera I'm sitting down and I'm finally getting back into writing it's like 8 30 but I've been pulling stick it notes off my walls for the last couple days which is so awesome because that means that I'm getting getting things done I'm, I'm down like I've probably pulled like five or six off in the last couple days which is awesome and there's probably a couple more I can pull down um, but I'm still feeling great because it looks like slightly less like a crazy lady's wall and more just like a passionate person's wall <laughs> that's weird anyways I just want to give a quick update and I shall continue trying to get through this first chapter. It's so long, it's so long, but we're getting there. Okay, so it is the end of the night now. It's about 20 after 11. That first chapter, it took me forever, seriously. I edited a total of just about 4,500 words today. But yeah, that chapter was just, it was a struggle to get through because I had to write almost the entire end of it and I still think there's a part 
that I need to figure out, but it's going all right. <laughs> a little stressed because in order for me to get through this edit, this revision, by the end of the month, I need to be doing just over 5,000 words every day. <laughs> Maybe not quite that much because there is, like I said earlier, a lot of like random notes and stuff that I've scooched in, but still probably around 5,000 every day. Didn't make that today, but that's fine because I know later on it'll be a little bit better. Like there was a chapter that I just put a check mark. It was fine. So yeah, it's a lot to do, but we're not going to get it all done today. So I'm going to go to sleep now. So with that, I'm going to say thank you so much for coming along on today's adventure and I will see you tomorrow when we do very similar things. Good night. Mm -hmm.